St. Edmund Campion, Society of Jesus, was an English Jesuit priest and was one of the 40 martyrs of England and Wales. His feast day is celebrated on the 1st of December. Edmund was born in London on January 25, 1540. He was the son of a bookseller in Paternoster Row, near St. Paul's Cathedral. He received his early education at Christ's Hospital School, and at the age of 13, he was chosen to make the complimentary speech when Queen Mary visited the city in August 1553. He became a scholar and junior fellow at St. John's College, Oxford in 1557 and took the required oath of supremacy in 1560. He took a master's degree at Oxford in 1564. Edmund welcomed Queen Elizabeth I when she visited the university. The Queen was so taken by Edmund's brilliance, her praise fed his vanity and eventually led him away from his Catholic faith. He took the oath of supremacy, acknowledged the Queen as head of the church, and received holy orders as a deacon in the Anglican Church. However, his conscience cannot reconcile with the idea of Anglicanism for too long. In 1571, Edmund left for Ireland where he was reconciled to the Catholic Church and received the Eucharist that he had denied himself for the past 12 years. When he entered the English college founded by William Allen, the enrollment grew. He found himself reunited with Oxford friends. He taught rhetoric and completed the Bachelor of Divinity granted him by the University of Douai on 21 January 1573. He received minor orders after this and was ordained subdeacon. Edmund went to Rome to join the Jesuits. He became the first novice accepted into the Society of Jesus by Mercurianus, the order's fourth superior general, in April of 1573. He was assigned to the Austrian province and began his two-year novitiate at Brunn in Moravia. He was ordained deacon and priest and said his first mass on the 8th of September 1578. That same year, his play Ambrosia was staged in Prague by the students of the recently founded Jesuit college Clementinum. For six years, Campion taught at the Jesuit college in Prague as a professor of both rhetoric and philosophy. In 1580, Edmund was chosen to take part in the Jesuit mission to England. Before embarking, they learned that a letter detailing their party and mission had been intercepted and that they were expected in England. He arrived in London on 24 June 1580 where he immediately began to preach. His presence soon became known to the authorities after which, he led a hunted life while administering the sacraments and preaching to Catholics. On his way to Norfolk, he was captured and taken to London with his arms pinioned and bearing on his hat a paper with the inscription, Campion, the seditious Jesuit. Edmund was imprisoned and tortured for more than four months. He was arraigned and indicted on the 14th of November 1581 with several others at Westminster on a charge of having conspired, in Rome and Reims, to raise a sedition in the realm and dethrone the Queen. Days later, they were found guilty of treason. After spending his last days in prayer, they were hanged, drawn, and quartered on the 1st of December 1581. Edmund Campion was beatified by Pope Leo XIII on the 9th of December 1886. He was canonized in 1970 by Pope Paul VI as one of the 40 martyrs of England and Wales. His feast day is celebrated on the 1st of December, the day of his martyrdom. The actual ropes used in his execution are now kept in glass display tubes at Stonyhurst College in Lancashire. Each year, they are placed on the altar of St. Peter's Church for Mass to celebrate Campion's feast day, which is always a holiday for the school. For more information about every saints and their feast day, Please like and subscribe to our channel, House of Prayers for Everyone.